Now let's go to New York, uh, where Carol, you used to live and where I used to live too. There, Democrat Governor Kathy Hochul has unveiled a proposed budget of $227 billion, as Dr. Evil would say. The budget is packed with a bunch of progressive spending priorities and banned the sale of gas cooktops by 2030s. Now, Carol, former fellow New Yorker, what are your thoughts on this? Are you glad you got out? <laughs> every single day. But I, I have to say what's really wild about Kathy Hochul's proposal, it's, it's first of all, it's not just the amount of startling amount of money that she wants to spend. Um, it's that A, she's come around to the idea that crime is bad, which is a step forward for her. But two, I mean, B, um, the Democrats in, in her state chambers want more money. They don't think that this is enough. They think that this is, um, you know, something a conservative Republican would offer. And she's getting attacked from from the left for not spending enough money. So yeah, every day I'm happy to be a Floridian. It's really no looking back. Wild stuff there. Now, Adam, this has got some interesting politics around it too, because New York was one of the states where Republicans had gains in the midterms and Hochul was for a time under threat mm. from the GOP. This, this was an extraordinary circumstance. I mean, people don't understand just how Democrat that state is. Is she playing with fire here? Yeah, look, I think she is. I mean, I, I think uh, that she's a very weak, a weak governor. And I was shocked recently when she said that one of the reasons that she wouldn't allow the rehiring of healthcare workers uh, who weren't vaccinated was because the vaccine stopped transmission. Uh, some of the journalists <laughs> in the room were actually shocked because, of course, it's now widely understood that that's not true. And, of course, there are, there, there are all sorts of shortages in New York in the healthcare sector. And this is because uh, thousands of workers have, have not been allowed to return to work. So I think that is becoming increasingly unpopular. Uh, to, just on the budget in general, you know, one of the nice things about uh, the American states is that they can't borrow money, uh, which is, you know, which is quite interesting from an Australian. Um, most of the states, I think including New York, have a balanced budget amendment, so they, so they don't have debt. So even though uh, Kathy Hochul can uh, propose these enormous uh, spending budgets, she's going to have to pay for it. And that, of course, means raising taxes, which is not popular. Indeed. And in fact, raising those taxes have driven an awful lot of New Yorkers out of New York possibly like Carol herself. Mm. 